Yo guys, well, what is up? It is Nick, and I am extremely sorry. Um, I was playing through, I got that thing fixed, but my recording mess, it's corrupted, so I can't even do anything, and I can't load back farther than where I am to that quest. This is, this is the manual saves that are, uh, messed up. I can't figure out how to complete it. So, um, I did get past it, so we are on Broken Flowers now. Uh, we missed all Novigrad gr Dreaming, um... I'm, I'm, just, I'm sorry about that. There's nothing I can do without completely starting a new game. And so I guess we're just going to hold off. We're just going to skip that in the recordings. But just know I did complete it. I guess I can show you my quest. Um, oops. Completed. Uh, it should be all the way at the bottom. Oh, no. There it is. Novigrad Dreaming. I did complete it. Uh, but you guys missed all that. We're supposed to go here and meet with... Uh, we're supposed to try to find Dandelion. Uh, that's what we're supposed to be doing now. Uh, the objective is just right up here, scandals. and so here we go. Let's we'll check it out. Was... Don't give a flying fuck. But yeah, just I'm I'm sorry, guys, for the issue and whatnot. But we are back with good reviews. Next time I'll rip your fucking legs off and shove them up your ass till you've toes for teeth. Gear up in the nick of time, as always. Zoltan, with your boot to someone's ass, as always. Who were those men? Local color. I wasn't gone more than a moment. Long enough for them to turn our home into theirs. All right, time for some spring cleaning. I've got to boot them all out. Care to join me? With pleasure. All right, buddies, let's do this. Back, get me back! Get him out. Oh. Flat freight. Hit him. Hit him with the left uh, hand. Oh, the kick. Case of war. Oh, yeah. down. It was like we never left Bergen. Oh, almost with a one shot. Oh, down he goes. Too easy. I'm pleased. That went well. Now we can greet each other like the gods ordained. Ages, pal. Hey, Zoltan. You look good. Training plenty lately. What with the war on, no Mahakaman meat to be found, but Redanian laggers standing in just fine. You, though, you've weathered a bit. Something worrying you. It's about Siri. I know she came to Novigrad. Might still be here. You mean she's come back? I'll be damned. I wonder if I'd recognize her. How many years is it now? Six? Seven? But what'd she be doing here? Hiding, probably. She might be in danger. See her in your dreams? Couple times. Her and the Wild Hunt. Oh. Not good. Not at all. But I know she came here and contacted Dandelion. <sighs> we have a wee problem, then. Where's Dandelion? <laughs> I'd like to know that myself. Maybe he could explain what the hell's going on. I just barely returned, as you saw. I'm expecting to come home to a hot leg of boar and some cold ale. And what do you find instead? A shite storm. Dandelion gone, the tavern chock full of bums. I've no clue what happened. Hmm. Let's look around. Might find something that'll put us on his trail. Prime idea. I say we start on the ground floor. It's where he sat and wrote. Okay, also what I forgot to mention is I did most of this quest before I realized that um, Aha, my recording had messed up, so news. I actually know where the stuff Reading I need someone is. Else's letters. My visage red and hot. I plunged into purest ecstasy, imbibing its nectar. Your dexterous digits on my soul's yearning cords. But I am going to collect a lot of this stuff because... I could use the the alcohol to be able to restore some of my uh, my potions and stuff when I need them. Let's see, now we got more stuff here. All right, 
go ahead and look around a little bit more here, see what, what all we can From find. From the finest vineyards, every last one. No one knows the fruit of the fruit of the vine like dandelion. From the finest vineyards, every last one. No one knows the fruit of the fruit of the vine like dandelion. Okay, different stuff to loot over here. Alright, now, here we go. This is the thing I needed. Hmm. Ten barrels of Tucson Dry, five cases of sodden triple mead. Hmm, nothing here. No, 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 that's exactly what we're looking for. It says planner. Huh, dandelion and planning, good one. Besides, anything he wrote here probably had a special system. Chaos only he could ever decipher. Actually, in the past, sometimes not even that. Give him a chance. Might not be that bad. Seems when he inherited this fine establishment, it came with some fine responsibilities. Bookkeeping among them. He also made a habit of noting down the times of his meetings, official and private. So, who'd he been seeing of late? Ah, here it is. Hmm. Seems he's only been meeting women of late, the dog. Zoltan, please. You really want to track down the women Dandelion's been wooing? Most likely all angry women by now. Got any better ideas? Sides, Dandelion's a babbler. We're sure to know something of his doings. Hmm. We should divide these somehow. Perhaps... Ah, fuck it. I'll ask the lassies in my half, you interrogate the ones in yours. So, Che? Zoltan, wait. This is in verse. And you figure that's unnatural because... Wonderful. Meet me back here when you're done. Share our findings. Right, you up. Need to do a wee bit of tidying before I go. Cannot stomach the idea of coming back to this mess. And you'd be wise to read your bit before you scurry off. If you need anything, I'll be next door. All right. Now we got to read the planner. A uh, rose of our otter, like a rose bash abashed of its crimson hue, fair Rosa would sink into humor's blue. She shunned her lessons in civility to swing her dwarf with agility. A charming gardener or garden enclosed villa in Gido in Gildor. Molly. Though well she knows the touch of silk and lace, she shuns not straw when gripped in lust's embrace. Uh, Gildorf villa next to the morgue. Vespula! Though timid in looks, no adventure did skip her. My heart melts when she asks, ever had a big dipper. Far corners laundry near the mouth of the pontar. Marabella! Though her cries are divine when behind closed doors. Standing on stage, her squawks are drowned by snores. The bits near Popper Square. Uh, Ella Hall, a figure most rare, her, her nature duel. Look deep in her eyes or be made a fool. Taylor's shop across from the tannery. Alright. So, don't need to talk to Zoltan. You can just find out more information about the girls, uh, which you don't really need. So, let's go talk to Vespula. Hop on out here. Oh, we did level up to level 10. Alright. Let me this open character and let me remove this I did figure out I wanted to do this and adrenaline loss okay that's what I wanted I want to put it there so that they connect and then let's see put this up here for the boost and I want to put this over here and one don't is it this one that we're missing yes put that one there then i want to put this in there and get a little bit of a boost so there's all of that done let's head over here and talk to oops i want to talk to vespiola but okay i guess it'll give it to me anyway. i will get you every last copper with interest give me a week please horson's no banker he's an honest man you pay on time, you get protection. You don't pay. Help! You get bitch slapped in the what face. What you for, stupid wench? What are you hoping for? A knight in shining armor? 
Close enough. Keep out of this, Greyhead. Not your concern. This spewler has got someone else's protection now. Really? Who's that be? Mine. Offered her a better rate. All right. So, let's see if you're a good bargain, or just cheap shit. Hit him with that too. Oh, can hit him with the three hit. Yeah, you shouldn't have been being a little bitch with your crossbow, homie. Oh, 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 just destroyed. Why are you like naked? What are you doing? Dude's half naked. It's half naked and almost famous. All of it. So much work for naught. No need to thank me. It was nothing. Sorry. Don't get me wrong, I'm grateful, but everything I had, I just lost. Relax. It'll come out in the wash. Of course it will. Just gotta soak it in white vinegar, but that's not my point. Junior shan't forgive me. Either I'll close up shop myself, or he'll burn me down. Sorry. Didn't think about that. The woman's lot. Men have their fun, and we're stuck with a mess. Oh, well. I suppose I must move to Oxenfurt. Professors need clean undergarments, too. Don't know if you remember. We've met. I don't... Wait. Wait, I know you. You're that witcher I near clobbered with a vase when... Well... When you kicked Dandelion out. Through the balcony. Actually, he's the reason I'm here. Know where he is? Probably out whoring. That horse pheasant. That lion scoundrel. Ouch. What did he do to get your goat? Same thing as ever. Prize bullshitter came back, saying it was till death do we part this time. And? No more than a week passed before I spotted him in Harborside, strolling with some trollop on his arm. Twas the last straw. All those questions about the washerwomen at the bathhouse, then this. I beat him black and blue and threw him out on his ear. This woman he was with in the harbor. Who was she? Claimed she was his niece from Covia. Ha! <laughs> Horvia, more likely. Course it so tight her eyes were popping out her head. His too, come to think of it. An artist or a whore. Doesn't much matter as they're one in the same. Dandelion ask you about other washerwomen? Not terribly subtle, even for him. Maybe he likes some sudsy. Ah. Uh, maybe. But what did he ask about, exactly? Oh, this and that, really. What's it like at the bathhouse? Have I got any friends there? What are their working hours? I don't know. Maybe he's looking to hire one for his tavern. Maybe I got all in a huff for no reason. Thanks for your help. Listen, when I find Dandelion, anything I should tell him? No. I mean, tell him he's a two-faced snake, but it would be nice if he dropped by. She still, she still wants his D. She still wants the dandelion D. Okay, let's go ahead and collect the different items from these fine gentlemen I destroyed. Rodhead bolts. <laughs> all right, loot all that stuff. All right, let us go find. I want to find Ella Hall next. Let's go find Ella Hall. She is over this away. I wanted to do a ton of recording today, but it's it's already 11:30, and um, you know I got up at eight to to do some recording on my day off today, and uh, which just kind of it's just kind of frustrating because I had the visual issues when I couldn't figure out how to burn that stuff, so I had to redo it, and then. I've had these recording issues, so I've had to redo this part. Uh, it's just kind of frustrating. Welcome, Duke. It's just extremely frustrating. I'm a friend of Dandelion's. Looking for Ellie Hal. You've come to the right spot. How might I be of service? Need something shortened? Patch your trousers, darn your socks. You, Ellie Hal? Yes. Now pick your jaw up off the floor. 
Sorry, I thought... Thought Elihal was one of Dandelion's girlfriends. Oh, so it's that. Wait here. Any better? So you're... Elihal. Did you and Dandelion... I mean... How did you two meet? I met him one night in a tavern. He was blind drunk. Don't think I want to know what happened next. Oh, stop. He wasn't so drunk as not to figure it out. Besides, men don't interest me. I told him that from the start. Luckily, Dandelion's an open-minded fellow. We had a lovely evening. He became a loyal customer afterwards. You know what? I don't want to know anymore. <sighs> Thanks for your help, and uh, nice to meet you. I can help with much more. If you need new trousers or a vest, you know where to find me. He doesn't have anything important to say. If you go through his dialogue, he mostly just talks about how Dandelion came to see him and get his stuff fixed and all that different stuff. Nothing, nothing of true importance, really. Uh, that's really why I'm skipping it, because there really isn't anything of importance you need to know. Alright, so let's go talk to Molly. Um, you know, I've been doing most of the dialogue in the game, but I've already heard that one, and it's not of importance, really. So that's kind of why I skipped it, because I know someone will be wondering. It's a long little trek here to get to Molly's. This is where I stopped and noticed the recording was kind of down, was halfway through uh, talking to Molly. And that's when I noticed the recordings were getting corrupted. This is, which is just annoying. My recordings usually just don't record if they mess up. They usually don't corrupt, so it's a little weird that they corrupted. All right, Molly, let's go. Come out of your house. There's some guards, though, so this one's a little bit different. She might be a little more important. This Baronet's love of Let's Villa. Shouldn't interest you. The Baroness don't mingle with just anyone. Don't worry. I'm here to see your chambermaid, Molly. Out of the way. Baroness is right now. Be gone. Greetings, Witcher. Must admit it's curious to see you here. I don't quite believe in coincidences. Geralt of Rivia. Slayer of monsters. And my son. You're right, General. My visit's no accident. I'm looking for someone. There's no one here who wishes to see you. Captain, this man is not to enter. Forgive me, Morvran, but I've lost my appetite for the races. Kill a woman's son and appear at her doorstep? My, my. I thought witches had better survival skills than that. Looking for a girl named Molly. Heard she works here. I feel your information's out of date. Molly no longer works here. Baroness fired her? Quite the contrary. Molly decided she no longer wished to serve. After Arian's demise, Luis's nephew came to pay his respects. Got one clance of Molly and, well, they wed soon after. They now await his inheritance. With the Paranus's son dead, the estate will go to the nephew and Lady Lata, known until recently simply as Molly. All right, so where will I find the newly minted Lady Lata? Our dear little Molly has a new passion, horse racing. To my knowledge, she should be at Countess Vagelbud's villa right now. That's exactly where I'm going. Since you stripped me of Louise's company, perhaps you'd agree to come along. Well, if Molly will be there... On our way, then. Alright, get a companion for our trip to, to talk to Molly at the races. 
I don't get why I'm riding bareback. Why don't I? Where's Roach? Can I just whistle and Roach will appear out of nowhere? But I really am confused on why I'm riding bareback. It's not like I don't have a saddle. Here we go, we are t going to talk to Molly. Get near the end. We'll probably do the Molly part. We'll talk to Molly and then we'll call it an episode, guys. But I do hope you guys are enjoying this Witcher 3 playthrough. We're getting pretty far. I'm really excited to finish up Unity uh, and then be able to go and um, start up our hardest difficulty playthrough of this game. Uh, I'm looking forward to that. We've arrived. Nice place. I must say, of all the creatures in this region, I find steeds most intriguing. Horses interest you at all, Witcher? All the same to me. Call each one I ride Roach. Strange. The Grey is Cantarella, sired by Cahir, the champion from Vol. Yeah. Grey's a good color. Even looks good on horses. My coin's on the Black Stallion, Nemrod, purest Nilfgaardian stock. Surprised he didn't salute you, General. Seem to know your horses. I find them to be far more honest than men. Must say, I'm curious how you manage in the saddle, Witcher. Mostly just try to stay in it. What would you say to a little race? Not what I came here for. Don't make me beg, Witcher. Tell you what, win and I shall give you my finest saddle. Made in Nilfgaard proper of beautifully tanned leather. Hmm. All right, let's go. Why not? Wouldn't mind seeing if your knowledge of horses translates into riding skills. Ha! <laughs> Splendid! In that case, you must choose a mount. I'll ride Nemrod. Pit a Nilfgaardian stallion against a Nilfgaardian general. In that case, I shall try my luck on the Zeracanian Bay. The horses are saddled. Let's begin. All right, let's go. Let's win ourselves a new saddle. I'm using uh, the Black Stallion, so this should be interesting. Riders All right, ready. here we go. All right, go, the go. Oh, it's not running. There we go. Come on. Taking the lead early. Let's go. Uh oh, crap, crap. Turn, turn. Thought you might have to jump over that uh, because. Um, you know, it would have been kind of cool to have, like, an obstacle like that that you had to jump over. Do I... Oh, just I check I was like, is that victory? Okay. Go. I'm gonna have to just Come on, gallop now or canter. Oh, cut him off! Cut him off! No, cut him off! Oh, no. Come on. Come on. Here we go. Let's go. To retake my lead. Bump him out of the way. Let's go. Go, baby, go, baby, go. Is this the W? Is the W coming up here? Is this victory? Yeah! Let's go. Get that W. Get that new saddle. The roach I chose put in a nice run. Exceptional. I've not lost the race in a while. I congratulate you. That is yours. Thank you, Superior Racing Saddle. Ah, look! Lady Latar has just arrived. Who? The woman formerly known as Molly. There she stands. Right. Thanks. I shall be here for a time. Find me if you'd like to ride back to the city together. Will do, homie. Will do. Hey, let's go talk to Molly. Let's see what she's got to say. Watch her brush her hair. Who do you favor, milady? Can't decide between the black stallion and the grey mare. Keep going back and forth, back and forth. Sorry, don't believe we've been introduced. I'm Geralt. Geralt? That Geralt? The one Dandelion's rescued time and time again? That's right. Except it's the other way around. I'm always saving him. 
mean to say it weren't Dandelion saved you in Flotsam by severing your noose with an arrow from a hundred paces? What? Dandelion couldn't... <sighs> Never mind. Any idea where our master archer might be at the moment? No. Sadly, I haven't got a clue. We've not seen each other in ages. Ever since I became Lady Latard, it's been nothing but balls, banquets, and other such... What's it? Congregations. Awful time in all this. But... <laughs> or maybe his sister could help you. Such a nice girl. You do realize Dandelion doesn't have a sister? Sure he does. Saw him himself. Funny, she don't look like him at all. Blonde, for starters. Maybe they've different fathers. Mm-hmm. Different mothers, too. Maybe. But you could see he cares for her. Looks after her. The way he carried her packages and... Know where I can find her, Dandelion's sister? I know. Whenever I ask Dandelion when we visit her, he'd grow all quiet and then change the subject. Any chance you remember your last conversation with Dandelion? Of course. He came to borrow some coin for a barge. What? Why'd he need a barge? To take me on a romantic cruise of the canals by the light of the moon. He said there'd be strawberries and that wine with the bubbles. And he'd sing me arias. But I've not seen him since. I'm under the impression Dandelion thinks you still serve the lavalettes. Oh, that's because I never told him I stopped. Didn't want him to treat me any different. And your husband has nothing against it? Your old friendship? Course not. Sweetiekins couldn't be happier that Dandelion's raising me sophistication. Alright, so the top one is just a repeat. Thanks, Molly. Wait. So I'll head out. Before you go, I've got a request. Dandelion told me once he'd show me his etchings, but he never did. And I'd so like to see him. Won't be too hard to convince him. He loves showing off those etchings to anyone he can. Oh, that's wonderful! Thanks! And good luck to you on your search. Yeah, thanks, Molly. Thanks for all the help. Alright, return to Novograd. On your own or with Voorhees? We're gonna return with Voorhees. Then probably call ah, an episode. There you are. Shall we return together? Gladly. It's a long way to Novograd. Road ought to seem shorter with some company. I'd say the same. Well then, let's go. Alright, so we have two more ladies to talk to. Trying to find Dandelion here. It's kind of weird. We haven't been in combat for a while. Especially I haven't. I've been running around just looking at different stuff. I haven't had to fight. Which is kind of interesting. I haven't had to fight any enemies for a while. Maybe we'll get jumped on the way back and I'll have to fight someone. Because I'm kind of missing the combat system. We're just doing a whole lot of talking and running around. So it's been, it's getting kind of weird not doing anything. Also, these loading screens. Getting kind of sick and sitting, them, sitting in them. Alright, we are back in Novigrad, finally. And here we are. Thank you for your company. Likewise. See ya. Alright. So we're done with Molly. Now we need to, uh, one of the last two that we need to talk to. We need to talk to Marabella and Rosa Var Atter. So I will get to those after, uh, or not after, in the next episode. Let me go grab... Oh. Alright. That's kind of weird. Grab these off of the board. 
Alright guys, that's going to do it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you guys in the next one, where we'll, we will be talking to Marabella and Rosa Otter. I'm sorry about the mix-up with the last, um, the last mission that we were supposed to do, the Novik or Ed Dreaming. Nothing I could do about it. I'm uh, just super sorry. Just wanted to apologize to you guys, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Peace out.